<laughs> Couldn't get out of that. What the hell? Okay, so now we're going to look at a painting. Or look at Nobody a painting. in this town has a fucking clue as to what's happening. Or do they? Well, everybody else seems to. Look at the door. I better not go in there. David might be in bed. Ew. <laughs> yeah, really. For everybody else in the neighborhood, it's just another morning. And to you, it is two days before apocalypse. Good luck with that. Anyway, let's go downstairs and have some breakfast. Because, quite frankly, we were hungry. Left now, but go downstairs! Stop singing, girl. You do not know anything about singing. Look at the photos. Oh, what the hell? Huh. Alright. Photos. Look at this. Looks like a message. Let's play it. David, this is Officer Corn. Just want to let you know your stepdaughter's car was identified near the Blackwell campus last night, around the time of the break-in. What? You... Okay, that's why I wanted you to hear, and we're gonna erase it. That's what we did last time. Message deleted. Goodbye, message. I think Chloe has earned a break from all this bullshit. Yeah, she does. She has to know and open the door. Okay, we haven't been in here. We haven't been out here. Before. Three dead birds lined up? That's fucking ominous. Yes, it is. Sit in the swing? I remember when Chloe and me would take turns in the swing. We would push each other so hard we'd fly way up in the air. Chloe always wanted to swing all the way around. I always got scared and would jump off before I flew off. And Chloe is still trying to get high. I guess that's it. That's all there is. Wow. There's a lot of fields in that. I wonder how these birds died. Probably David's shooting shooting some. He's doing some Duck Dynasty bullshit going on. Ooh, dead bird. Poor thing. He's gonna eat him. Yum yums. For his tum tums. You know. I can't go in that door, obviously. Sorry. There's a grill. We can't use it. We can't grill. I want to grill the birds. Can I do that? Please? They're, they're dead anyway. I might as well just, you know, eat them. Alright. No dice. Okay. Let's go in, back inside. We'll hear this main story. Again, again, this is my second playthrough. Is not my first. Who drinks beer this early around here? I don't know. Maybe Dave. But anyway. Because the last one I tried, the voiceover did not record. Everything else did. Perfectly, except my voiceover, which I'd say, you know what? Fuck you. Fuck you, recorder. You know. Alright, let's go talk to, talk to Joyce. Let's Good morning, does. Joyce. Rachel, uh, uh, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. We did the pancakes. Let's try the eggs and bacon. Eggs and bacon all the way. Remember when you guys would sleep in until I yelled out, Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. Totally. We wake up so fast. So this time you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the actual eggs and the bacon. Eggs and bacon. Now, I if can you... handle eggs and bacon. Now, if we wanted to do the... uh wanted to do the pancakes, we have... Grab the eggs and the milk, which we can. Eggs I should evolve and become a vegan, but 
Huh. Bacon. Baconist. Now, no matter what, we need to get the eggs. The eggs are over here. It took me a little bit over to figure this out. Because you would think the eggs would be in the fridge, right? No! They're over here! She forgot to put her goddamn groceries away! The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. What's this leaflet? I didn't see this before. This might be the one time oh, that did. these people are right. Okay. The pamphlets that Jehovah's Witnesses sometimes give you. Alright. Eggs and bacon, and don't get caught up on the wall, ma'am. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a okay, yeah. since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but we are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or wherever she is. She okay? Be honest, Joyce. Do you think Rachel is okay? God, I hope so. She was, is smart. And she always landed on her feet. Maybe I don't know her as well as I thought. Maybe Chloe doesn't either. Sometimes I feel like I don't know Chloe as well as I thought. <laughs> Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? Yes. Mm, no way. <laughs> no way. I know I was selfish when I left. I'm glad Chloe found a better friend. No, just a different one. Last time I saw you and Chloe in your pirate outfits, I knew she would never find a better friend. I just wish you could have stopped Chloe from getting busted by David for that joint. I know, but it seems like Chloe and me were pirates a thousand years ago. And that makes me what, a century old? <laughs> you were only 18, Max. Oh, yeah. Only 18? If only I could go back. She's it's only 18? Old, what? Choice. I thought she was older well, than that. A breakfast fit for us queens. I shouldn't say that. <laughs> go sit at the table. No! You don't tell me what to do. Not my mom. Look at cereal. Wowzer. Chloe still eats the Wowzers. cereal. What are you, Inspector so Gadget now? Newspaper. Sit at the chair. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. Because there was an option. Something about watering a plant. Jeez, uh, can you help me get this bird out of here? Wait a minute. Open the window. I keep expecting to see the sky turn red. Joyce, what about, where's the bird? Joyce looks so different in her street clothes. You said it was a bird. Where's the bird? I guess not. I guess there's no such thing as a bird in that place, so... We'll just sit down! Why? Because we can! And just wait! <laughs> you dance um, you can't sing, you can't dance. Thank you for the pancakes, or I'd be the ace bacon. Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good, you can clean. Ah, uh, fuck you! Okay, you don't tell me what to do. You know what, let's... Bring let's... those eggs and bacon to my belly. Let's look at the plant. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Let's eat. Maybe we could give the plant the milk. You think plants would be liking milk? I mean, they drink water all the time. Maybe it's time for a change. Change the scenery, maybe. What are you doing? Oh, man. I don't want to be famous for this. But you are, so deal with it. Peanut butter. I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. But I like crunchy. Seeing you again ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. 
My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Yeah, he uh, isn't. I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Yeah, you do. The Firefly right there. Wow, Firefly, what? What's with I the... totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this. And... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, morbid. I want you to have this. This was when morbid. the baby was so the full eye of is light, and light. She was hopeful, positive. Everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Okay, now. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Feed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, okay, yeah, that's right. We gotta go. Up in my shit. The reason why uh, we're here. I can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me. I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. <laughs> Now, who's being paranoid? <laughs> go off and pee! <laughs> like, no, randomly go off and go to the bathroom. You're gonna have to hold it. Well, I, well you I listen to me, to bitch. I need to get into David's computer. He's gotta be hiding shit. Okay, is this a different one every no time you play? You password. How about step douche? Try again. I need more clues. Alright, which is the one... Okay, now, the first time I played this... I only thought there was Nothing a few, there was a few passwords that we actually was able to get, but there's like tons of them. Maybe I could try stepdad for the password. Greens of Arcadia Bay. Keys. So every time. You find one of these things that has like a code or a particular Nothing keyword. To see here. It adds an option to the to the final pass the password options. Naturally, you David would buy a heavy it. duty military. I well, actually go to enter it by the way. That I should it might say. be a useful password. Like this padlock here. Read seven one seven one. Gun rack. Switch on the gun rack. Look at the padlock. There's no way Chloe can put that gun back now. Let's see, search. Huh. Maybe this ID number might work. Three, four, five, whatever. Back. Let's see if I remember what the password actually was, though. I think you have, you have to find the one that it. I that could it's try on. the license number for the password. In order to actually get in there before it will actually show up, can't just. Looks like David has read this a lot. What did he learn? It won't show up, I should say. Cute. Can't picture David driving Joyce around with this on the car. Okay, tape. Search the tape. Obviously, David's parents care about him. That date might be a good password. Another password. Sun visor. Sun visor. Said sun visor. Search sun visor. Joyce might as well have wrote "Let's get married." That might be a useful password. Car. Let's look at the car now because the car it's so shitty. This is a better hobby for David than surveillance. <sighs> Door. Do we open? I still need to find the password okay. to David's computer. What's this? How? Search for what? That's cute. Could be a password here. To a real life hero. Okay. 
think we got all the passwords we could possibly get in here. Search true. David has been dragging his head around since 2001. Oh yeah, that is another password. Okay. I couldn't remember if that was a password that we could try or not. Let's see. Personal. Let's see. I can't remember what it actually was. There we go. Four. Max the hacker strikes again. First Whoa. try. Spoiler alert. I was trying to figure out what if I remembered. definitely hooked up with Frank. But why does David care? Read. Rachel Ambo's profile, which has been cutting all cla cutting class all week, because he's stalking people. That's why he cares. He's just a regular creeper. Frank and Rachel meet once again. Rachel avoids her dormitory. Followed Rachel to lighthouse. Case number six seventy eight. He's been doing this all the time. Anderson Berry incident report. Rachel Amber eighteen was picked up at two thirty five p.m. by Blackwell Academy. For possession of a controlled substance, this was reported by David Madsen, heads of campus security. He witnessed her trying to hide or secure a suspicious medical bag. This officer was called in to question Miss Amber, who responded with threats and denials. Her bag was found to contain very various illegal pharmaceuticals. See attached page for full details. Instead so of stalking Kate, David could have helped her. This is so wrong. Oh my god. <sighs> Creepy bastard. Okay, Max Caulfield profile, Mac all oh, aliases, Mad Max, Mad Max Factor? Max Factor? What? Noir nor nor blah, 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 blah. I can't pronounce the anything today. Whatever, Angel. Let's do that. Noir, that's what it is. Max uh, Maxine Caulfield, student B one O T two one F two O one five. Max class is scheduled October week second. School schedule 2000. Damn. What's he gonna do? Follow her around? Oh, shit. I wanted to read this. Kate M follows the same path to every class. Overheard Kate and Dana W talk about supplies for Tortex party drugs. Wow. Jesus. I better tell Chloe about this now. It's just one more thing to make her sad and mad. All right. Coming up, it's the next of the major decisions. Taylor. Me and Max just wanted to thank you for actually giving this shit about me and my mom. Did well, so much I care about Kate and nobody else did. Thanks, Taylor. I know you care too. If you're going to the party, I'd love to style you up if you want. I, If I do go, I would love to get a Taylor makeover. Talk soon. Speak. Oh, but here comes the asshole. Nice breakfast. David, you're back already? <laughs>